Welcome back to Cardio News Channel 13 at noon. Thanks so much for joining us this Thursday afternoon. It's a gorgeous view over La Vida. This from our exclusive Your Wireless Neighborhood Weather Network camera. Our weather story today, the mild and pleasant conditions out there. It is picture perfect. We have lowered some fire danger. Wind speeds are still a bit breezy for some areas, but for the most part, more or calmer, I should say, compared to what we've seen the last couple of days. This is a view from our Philong Dealerships Neighborhood Weather Network camera. Some sun glare and great visibility beyond that. This from our Century Casino Neighborhood Weather Network camera. Great day for a walk around Cripple Creek. Again, lots of blue sky, sunshine, just a couple of clouds. I showed you this earlier, but I have to show it to you again. Temperatures stay above average in the 50s and 60s. For northern El Paso County, we stay in the mid to upper 50s. 50 is also the name of the game for Manitou Springs. Pueblo West, 60 degrees on the dot, staying in the upper 50s for Colorado City. Walsenburg, Aguilar, Trinidad, those areas staying in the mid to upper 50s. Primarily this afternoon, we'll reach the 60s and the 70s once more with lots of sunshine. Wind gusts won't be all that impressive throughout the rest of the afternoon. While we could see some gusts up into the 20 mile per hour zone, for the most part along the I 25 corridor, we'll stay under 15 miles an hour. Live HD Doppler radar is showing dry conditions right now, and we stay dull on Doppler throughout the rest of the afternoon and into the evening. Here's a look at 5 p.m. on Skycast. During this time, you just see some high level clouds filtering on in. Midnight, we'll have mostly clear to partly cloudy skies into Friday morning. We stay crystal clear, but take a look at what happens throughout the day on Friday. We added more clouds to the southwest portion of the state with more showers filling in from the southwest to the northeast. Showers tomorrow look to stay in the high country. Here's a look at 5 p.m. Tomorrow, while we can't rule out a spotty shower in Teller County, others will dodge showers and storms. We'll just see some more clouds generally across southern Colorado tomorrow, with even more clouds going into Saturday and Sunday. See the stormy icons over the weekend? I'm not expecting the weekend to be a washout. The morning time frames look all right, but it's going to be the afternoon and evening when we add in the chance for scattered showers. Monday, more widespread showers anticipated with some rounds of afternoon storms coming Tuesday and Wednesday. Upper 60s for tomorrow in Pueblo. A pair of 74 Saturday and Sunday. Better chance for showers going into Sunday and Monday. For Canyon City, 66 for tomorrow. Low 70s Saturday and Sunday. Yes, the chance for a spotty shower on Saturday, but uh, more widespread showers anticipated for the second half of the weekend. 57 for Teller County going into tomorrow. Slight chance of showers tomorrow, and we look rather wet and unsettled Saturday all the way through Wednesday. We will have a check of your hour to hour afternoon temperatures coming up next. Uh, don't worry, though, you might be dodging a few raindrops, but not a total washout. Not for a total most. washout for True. most Saturday.